Let's give it a shoot for our intersection again. We did before. <laughs> oh, come and get them, girls. It's not a sight you see every day, a hot air balloon floating around your neighborhood looking for a place to land. But according to Kelowna resident Bruce Hedman, he's seen it before. The balloon was seen landing on Packers Road in Kelowna. Coming down right into my neighborhood. I had this guy come and land in my neighborhood. A couple of years ago, I did the exact same thing. We had him floating down into our, into our neighborhood. And I took some still shots and sent them into Castanet at the time and questioned how come this guy can be landing his hot air balloon in a residential neighborhood, right? It, lo it always looks very dangerous. Looks like he's going to land on somebody's house. And at the time, the fellow who owned the hot air balloon came back and talked to Castanet and said, oh, no, it's very safe. You know, we have a chase car that's close at hand. But I just got this thing about a hot air balloon landing in a residential neighborhood. I know other, pe other people have had the same thing happen in Kelowna with the same balloon right, where he, you know, he gets blown around by the wind, so you never know where he's going to end up. So sometimes, you know, it just looks a little precarious for people who live in a, in a neighborhood where a hot air balloon is about to land. But there is no protocol for him. There is no, you know, there's no safety piece with the, you know, the aviation authorities in Kelowna that say you can't do this or can't do that. Uh, the take is that he's a hot air balloon, and he, because it's a hot air balloon, he's not under power. He goes wherever the wind blows him. If you recognize the balloon or know the owner, you can email us to news at castanet.net. For Castanet News, I'm Madison Earhart in Kelowna.